Terrell Wright, backdoor cutting, Pettis catches, shoots, and scores! And the Explorers lead it 4 0. The key right gets a steal, they tip it ahead to Galloway, throws it down! And the Explorers come right back in front with a 6 5 lead. Now there's White, slams down the two handed jam on the hesitation and cut through. White's going to set a pick, rolls it to Pettis, Pettis for three! Oh, Pettis! I did 16, 12 45 to play. Galloway, left-handed dribble, defender falls down into the paint, kicks it back out to Dern for three, pow! He has the answer, second block coming from Taylor. Crossover by Lyons, and a Zach answers with a block of his own, and then is fouled on the play. Wow, the Explorers come to play. They lead it 19-18 with 11.50 to play. Zach sets a pick, now rolls to the bucket. White, pump, fakes a pass, and dives, dishes it off to Zach, trapped underneath, reverse layup, up and in! The freshman with a big play. Door Galloway, but White's gonna keep it himself. Kick it back to Duran for three. Do it! Tyreek Duran knocks it down, and the Explorers lead it by six. Duran rolls it back to Pettis, fakes the three, now he's gonna drive on freeze, takes it to the rack and finishes. Near side Duran. Duran's gonna dribble to his left, jump, stop and roll back to Galloway for three. Nailed it! Remote Galloway with a triple, his second of the game. Jumper won't go, Mills has a three on one break, Galloway on his left, kicks it, alley-oop, and Galloway catches, no good, Mills gets the put back. Rebound, pulled down by Duran. Duran wants to beat everybody on the floor, weaves his way, rolls it back to Mills for three. Pow! Sam Mills with a triple, and Chris Mack has called a timeout as the Explorers have built a 34-24 advantage. Walker again, he's gonna pull up for three. That will not go. Devin White keeps the rebound alive and the Explorers get a second look. Devin is very, very active right now at both ends of the floor. Great hustle to get a hand in that rebound. Pettis has Dern cutting through the lane. Layup good! And the Explorers are up by a dozen. And then a travel on the inbounds to Holloway, forced into a turnover. The Explorers have a chance to put that pedal down if they can cash in here. Turnover number seven on the Muskie. Eight seconds left. They're not on the floor. It's Mills handling, kicks it back to Galloway for three. Remote Galloway for three! That's how the half will end, and the Explorers take their largest lead of the game into the break, 46 to 30. Uh, it's always good to get um, great wins against good teams. Uh, matter of fact, great teams. And um, Xavier has um, a good rap sheet, um, being good. And um, we just came out um, and played together and fought and fought the whole 40 minutes. Right, right, trying to back his man down. To the paint he goes. Double pops up and under. Won't go. Gets his own miss. It puts that back up and in. Jarrell Wright with an offensive rebound and a put back. Lions looks to drive on Galloway, gets to the rack, and another charge called on Mark Lyons, and again it's Earl Pettis. Galloway looking to drive, kicks to the corner, ball loose, still loose. Devin White tips it to Pettis, Pettis layup good, and this time the ball goes the Explorer's way. Still down to 12, Peterson for three. DJ Peterson, and one! Makes the three, and then is fouled on the play. A potential four-point play as DJ Peterson Knocks it down to D. Davis picks up his third as Mark Lyons was waiting at the scorer's table. Yeah, well, listen, I, I think Xavier's one of the best teams in the country. We played great. Uh, only two teams have beaten their full team this year, us and Gonzaga. You know, that, the team we just beat, won on the road at Vanderbilt and uh, yeah, beat them, an awful lot of other good teams, Purdue and I think maybe Georgia. And, uh, you know, just a couple weeks ago, we're 9-0 in, in the country. They've had some adversity, and, and I'm sure they'll bounce back. Uh, but listen, I know they were motivated. They had their full team. They, they had a team that, like I said, has been ranked in, as a top 10 team. Uh, people said a potential Final Four team. So, that you know, it's great for us to beat a team like that. It's a tremendous thing for, for our young guys, and they've worked hard, and they, they, they deserve uh, the success. Davis drives, Mark Lyons misses the dunk and it goes out of play. And that's going to be the exclamation mark on a frustrating trip to Philadelphia for the Musketeers. Chris Mack has just called off the dogs. No fouls, the call from the bench. What a huge win for the Explorers to beat the preseason favorite when you were picked 13th in the league. Listen to Gola Arena soak it in. With 14 seconds to play, they do it, and they do it decisively. 80 to 70, the score's gonna finish up, and the Explorers have just sent notice to the A-10. Those blowout wins weren't a fluke, they're for real.